And there we saw the giants, the sons of Anak, which come of the giants. And we were in our own sight as grasshoppers. And so we were in their sight. You may be seated this morning if you have a, a need for a title this morning. I want to talk about the grasshopper mindset. All right. All right. The grasshopper mindset. That's all right. Today we live in a society yes, sir. That's it. where people <laughs> like to hop around. In today's society, yes, sir. As soon as someone do something to them at one church, they hop yeah. to another. Yes, sir. As soon as the choir members tell them, hey, you can't live that kind of way here at this ministry, they hop. Yeah. As soon as someone get on their last nerve or not speak to them in a certain way, they hop. Yeah. I'm talking about that grasshopper My. mindset. Yeah. The grasshopper will hop when they feel they are in danger. Yes, sir. I don't care how beautiful it is and how big it is, as soon as you try to grab its wings, mm -hmm. it's going to hop. Yes, sir. And if the truth be told, you know you're scared of that grasshopper in the first place. You yeah. really don't want to catch it. No. But in the church, we have something with the grasshopper mindset. There's yeah, well, four well. things I don't want to tell you about the grasshopper what, what? mindset. What? People with the grasshopper mindset uh -huh. don't see things for how they can be, but how things are at this time. Yeah. In other words, people with the grasshopper mindset do not have faith. No. They do not operate by faith. That's all right, Wilson. Right. They have to see it first yeah. in order to believe it. Uh -huh. Now Moses sent 12 spies to go out into the land to view it. Mm -hmm. And don't you know it's funny how sometimes two people can see one thing and see something different. Mm -hmm. You might see the glass half empty, mm -hmm. but the other person will see that same glass as half full. Yeah. You have to understand those that have the grasshopper mindset have to have things clearly laid out. Things have to be done already. Mm -hmm. Let me give you an example. When you go out fishing, you don't know what's in the water. Mm -hmm. But you put your rod and your reel or your cane pole out there anyway. And you don't know what's going to get on your line. No, sir. But you reel it in anyway. Mm -hmm. But when you reel in that fish, that fish has scales on it. Mm -hmm. In other words, there's some work you have to do with the fish that you caught. Yes. You got to clean it. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. But the people with the grasshopper mindset, they want to catch fish already clean. Yes. They don't want to get their hands dirty in the yeah. church. Yeah. They don't want to serve the Lord. They they want to wear out you and me. They they want to wear out. But every time it's time to eat, they hop to the table. They don't want to do anything that's going to cause any strain on them. They want to lay it out already. Yeah. Yes, sir. Come on. You're right. You can't get them to lift up a finger. Yeah. But in the first one. Yeah, at the table. Yeah. 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 That's what a grasshopper do. He grab, jump from one tree, eat it, move to the next. Yeah. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. They don't exercise faith. They don't realize that when you serve the Lord, yes, sir. when you help somebody else out, uh -huh. in your time of need, yeah. somebody's going to come yeah. to see about you. Yeah. Yeah. That's right. That's right. Come on. Come on. Ooh, gonna get they don't operate by faith. Mm -hmm. 
they operate by sight. Yeah. They went out into the land. They saw that the houses were built. They saw the vineyards already planted. They saw all of the wonderful things God said would be in the land. It would be a land flowing with milk and honey. And honey. Yes, yeah, sir. Doesn't mean that they're gonna have a whole lot of bees stinging. It just simply means that they're gonna have so Planet. much vegetation Planet. that's gonna have to be the need for pollination. Yeah. The bees are gonna be able to go all over yeah. and fertilize, yes, sir. do what they have to do to yeah. cause those plants to sprout. Yeah. Every flower becomes a fruit. Yes, sir. Hello. Yes, sir. It would be a land formed with milk and honey. That means that they would be able to have cattle on the land. Yes, sir. They would have enough, enough grass for the cattle to survive, to yes. sustain itself. That's right. They would have so much land. No yeah. To the east side and on the west side, to the north side and on the south side. Yes, sir. You won't be crowded. You would have a, a spacious land. This is what God told them he would give them. Yes, sir. But the people went there and they said, all of that is true. But they have giants mm -hmm. in the land. And in our own eyesight, uh -huh, uh -huh. we are like grasshoppers. Mm -hmm. God didn't say, you're a grasshopper. Yeah. This was what the people said about themselves. Yeah, yeah. Watch out what you say about yourself. Mm -hmm. Watch out how you pray. Well, some of us don't read our Bible, uh -huh. so we don't know what God says. No, no, that's right. Concerning us, right. we don't know that it says He has translated us from the kingdom of darkness into the kingdom of His dear Son. Yeah. Well, well, yeah. We don't realize that He's made us a kingdom of kings and priests. Yeah. We don't realize that we have been forgiven of all of our sins. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. So we go around praying, God, I'm unworthy, I'm unworthy, I'm unworthy, I'm unworthy. I'm unworthy, I'm unworthy. Yes, it's true, you are unworthy because he's the only one that is worthy. Yeah. yeah. But, but he did. But through his blood, he has made you worthy. Yeah. Yeah. To be a part of his family. Yes, sir. Yeah. Yeah. He don't want you to walk around with a low self-esteem. No, no. He wants you to realize that now you are his child. Yeah. And yes, you may have made mistakes yesterday. Yeah. But he's able to forgive you of your mistakes, yeah. clean you up, and give you a whole new life. Yeah. I don't care what the people say. Well, I remember when you used to. And how you used to cuss folk out and how you used to get drunk and how you used to gamble so much. And I know they want to remind you because they can't stand yeah. your new life. Yeah. Yes, sir. Well, I just have to tell you that not everybody is happy for you. Some people are waiting for yeah. you to fall. Yeah. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Well, I told you it was nothing to her. I told you she'd be back out here in the street. I told you it was just something passing. Yeah, yeah. Well they hate the fact that you now have God. Yeah. And you won't have to run after a man. You won't have to run after things yeah. to make you somebody. Yeah. Yes, sir. I'm happy with Jesus yeah. alone. Yeah. Yes, sir. That's all right. I wish I could tell you the, yeah. the grasshopper mindset can get you in trouble. Yeah. Because it causes you mm -hmm. to complain. Yeah, it does. Yeah, there's some folks, all they do in the church is complain. Yeah, well, yeah.